GZ Army, what's going on? Mr. AG here bringing a Pokemon X and Y battle. This time it's up against Aaron. Aaron has got this Caesar, the Metagross, the Agron. That's three steel types right there. It's got the Flareon, it's got the Tyranitar, and the Garchomp. I'm running with Conkledur. We've got the Infernape, Rotom Wash, Ditto, Nitto King, and Absol. Do me a favor, hit that like button and go ahead and share this battle video as we begin it here with Aaron. Ready to go, really pumped up for this. It should be a great battle here. Awesome music by Glitch City, guys. Check her out. So here we go. Aaron is issuing a challenge, ready to go, proposing a battle request. Fine, let's do this. Garchomp comes out. We're going to send out Conkledur to begin the battle. Conkledur comes out, takes his Dragon Rush. Surprising move here. No, not a lot of people run Dragon Rush, and it probably usually isn't used properly, and it shouldn't be used, actually. We're going to go ahead and run Drain Punch. Drain Punch is going to give us some health back and take the... Garchomp down to below half health, which is what we need, thank goodness. Here comes that EQ. EQ is going to hurt us, but we're going to be able to take it. Take it like a champ with 6 HP left. We're going to go ahead and watch him lose HP, and we're going to run this Drain Punch. Take that HP right back to us. So we're going to go ahead and recover some of our health here. Recover health up to 43 HP. Garchomp done and out. So that's looking good on our part right there. Next comes the Metagross. Meta Gross. Do I want to attack him or do I want to switch out? We're going to go ahead and switch out right now while we have this chance. And we're going to send out the Rotom. Rotom comes and we'll be able to eat up any kind of steel attack. Here goes a Bullet Punch. It does 9 damage. We eat it up. Here comes a Hydro Pump your way, Rotom. Rotom representing Hydro Pump on that Meta Gross. Does a decent amount of damage. Zen Headbutt. Oh my goodness. Gets that crit hit. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. It's like, really, really, why is everything working against me? The bullet punch is going to take me out because I don't have 9 HP. And, uh, yeah, I didn't want to switch out because um, everything else would have been bad switching in on. So he's going to recover a little bit more. Things not looking good here. We're going to go ahead and send out the Nidoking King next. So Nidoking King comes out next. We're going to go ahead and get this Fire Blast off. Fire Blast Nidoking King with the Share Force and Life Orb is going to take this guy out. So Metagross... Thank you for coming. Bye-bye. Down he goes. Run Force comes next. It's this Tyranitar. Look at it. It's amazing. Tyranitar. Nobody expected him, did they? But we're going to run Earth Power. I know Tyranitar is specially defensive. So we're, we know he's probably going to survive. And he does. He runs Dragon Tail. Oh my goodness how thankful I am he ran Dragon Tail. Then another move. So here comes my Absol. Absol was dragged out. We're going to get buffeted by the Sandstorm. And we are going to go ahead and Mega Evolve while we have this chance. So here we go. Mega Absol making an appearance here. Bam. What's going on, buddy? We're going to run Super Power. That's right. Super Power Mega Absol. And down goes the Tyranitar. Mega Absol is useful for once for me. Yay, Mega Absol. Down goes Run Forest, which is fantastic. Fantastic. Totally into that. So Absol is buffeted by the Sandstorm. And now we're waiting for our next opponent, and it's Caesar. Caesar comes out ready to go do some action here. He's going to Mega Evolve as well. So, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Mega Evolving Caesar. Look at that. Look at that. So we're going to go ahead and get this Sword Stance while we get a chance here. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Swords Dance, Swords Dance, Swords Dance, and here comes the U-Turn. That's going to be super effective. And that knocks us out. <laughs> oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. That, that's, sad. that's sad. That breaks our heart. So anyways, here comes Wilson, which I love the name, by the way. Wilson! The Agron comes out. We're going to send out Nitto King here. Now, Nitto King has Earth Power. We're going to go ahead and run that Earth Power here on the Agron. And that's going to be a dead Aggron. We could have ran the Fire Blast, but I'd rather go for the 100% accurate attack. So, it works. It takes him out. Next, he's going to send out that Caesar. Caesar comes out, and we've got that Fire Blast. <laughs> fire Blast. Boom, baby! There goes Caesar. Goes down and out. And, oh, and things just looked great. Sandstorm subsides. Here comes Get to the Chopper. Get to the Chopper comes in. We're going to run Earth Earth Power on to get to the chopper. This Flareon surviving with that Focus Sash. 
Uh, here comes the dig. Dig, Flareon, you gotta be kidding me. If I had EQ, I would have totally ran it, but I didn't have EQ. So we're gonna go ahead and switch out to Infernape. I know Infernape's gonna die, but sometimes you gotta make that sacrifice. So Infernape's gonna take this dig. We're gonna go down because it's super effective. And it's a crit, not that it mattered. Crits for the win, I know, guys. Not that it mattered. And we're gonna go ahead and send out Conkledur. Conkledur comes in, and he's gonna finish that off with a mock punch. Get that priority attack to get the, the get to the top part down and out. Sorry, tongue tied there. So we defeat Aaron for an epic battle, guys. I thought it was great, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. If you did, smash that like button, share the video, guys. Give props to Aaron, and go ahead and leave a comment here. Let us know what you thought about the battle and what you would have done different, guys. All right, until next time, remember the road may be rough, but the journey will be unforgettable. Catch them all, guys.